love coffee, some love tea, but I love students who sing with me. I love students who sing with me. Some love bells that ring and chime, but I like to know that it's music time. I like to know that it's music time. With Miss Williams! Hey guys! I know it's really weird that we're not together right now and not making music, but I figured while we're at home, we can find cool things at home to make music with. So I know your parents are gonna thank me later, but today we're going to find things in our kitchen that we can make music with. So I can't wait to get started. The first thing that we can find in our kitchens are things that are made of wood. Now, anything that is made of wood can be the same thing as our rhythm sticks or our tick tock block. These are things that you probably don't have in your home, but you might have spoons, wooden spoons, and they make very similar sound. All right, there's different ones. I got flat ones. And then I have these weird, like, I don't know, wooden chopstick things. Makes me get little hot things out of my toaster oven. They kind of make a sound, cool sound too. Also, if you have a rolling pin, you can find something like parchment paper or something that, like a piece of paper and you can put it on your rolling pin and make a cool, like a guiro sound, like a, sh a scraper sound, sound, you know? Or you can hit it just like all the other wooden instruments. So I wonder if you have any of these things in your kitchen that you could make a wooden sound with. Why don't you try to find out? Next, we're going to look for things that are metal. So, things that are made of metal. In our music class, we have things like the triangle. Dinner! This belongs in the kitchen, right? And then we have things like, you can't see me, like our little finger symbols. But we can't find finger symbols in a kitchen, right? I don't think I can butter my bread with finger symbols. So, what can we find in the kitchen that's made of metal? Hmm, let's go find some things. Some things that I found in my kitchen are like whisking elements and they make a cool sound. Can you hear the sound? You can find things like a metal measuring um, cup, which makes a really cool sound, especially if you hit it with something metal. It kind of sounds like that triangle. Dinner! Dinner! Guess no one's hungry. All right, and then of course, our measuring spoons, those are great metal sounds. Measuring spoons. Now, this is a cool thing. This is a whisk, my metal whisk. You can maybe part in that. Ooh, that makes a cool sound. Listen. Ooh, that kind of, you can hit it. All right, and you can also try to hit it just by itself. Makes a cool sound. You got to be creative. Lastly, metal spoons. Now there's a, a cool way to play them. Oh, maybe I, did, I figured it out, but I'm not very good at it. <laughs> maybe someone you know how, knows how to play the spoons. But metal spoons, there you go. You got one thing, you have to have spoons in your house, right? Metal spoons that make a metal sound. What do we do next? What's another instrument we can find in our kitchen? Let's find out. What can we find in our house that makes a shaking sound? Let's find out. Oh, <laughs> I forgot you're still here. So in our house, we can find things that can sh make that shaking sound by finding some food objects that are maybe in containers, not too hard though, that can shake. So right here, my children's favorite snack, goldfish, has a shaking sound. Other things, you know, when I'm feeling the want to bake, you got some chocolate chips and a Tupperware. <laughs> this makes a great sound. And if you get hungry, just have one. Just have a snack. Other things <laughs> that you like can shake 
are things like rice. Now, this is my unopened package of rice. But if you put some rice in like a small Tupperware, it makes a great shaker. So we have small Tupperwares in my family, and this would be a great way, just a handheld, especially for my younger children, that you just put a little bit in there and shake it, and then you go, you have your own shaker. Kind of like this, these are little sprinkles. And you know what? This doesn't sound very loud. So you wouldn't annoy your parents this way if you made this shaker. Now, lastly, popcorn kernels. This is my favorite snack ever. Popcorn kernels, again, is a great way to make a shaker in a small little Tupperware um, or a little, little piece of container. So those are shaking. Huh, I wonder if we forgot any more instruments. What do you think? I think there's one more that we can probably find in our kitchen. Just go put this back away. What is this? This is a drum, specifically a hand drum. And I'm not sure about you, but not many of us have a hand drum laying around. So what can we use in our kitchen that makes a drumming sound? Hmm, let's go find some things. After all that snacking you did when you were making your shakers, you might have some empty containers. Something like, like this, a little tin can empty container. My son's favorite treat, chocolate covered cashews. And it has a plastic rim. Well, if you hit the plastic rim, too much fun. Little drum roll for so much fun in the kitchen! <laughs> Great thing. Other things, Pringles. Again, it's a long, ooh, that's a cool sound. Another drum, and we can use things like our metal spoon! Ooh, I'm gonna have a drum set. Hold on a second, hold on. Me, I'm just jamming here. I have too much fun in my kitchen. You know what? Lastly, Tupperware. Good old Tupperware. That is going to be a great sound. So if you don't have all these snacks like I do, get your spoon, get your Tupperware, and join along. See? Did you think that you weren't gonna have any musical instruments while you were home? I told you, there's lots of fun things you can find in your kitchen. And you know what? Next week, I'm going to be singing a song with you that I'm gonna need you to find those kitchen items for so you can join along. So this week, I want you to do lots of research, lots of experimenting, drive your parents a little crazy. Sorry, parents. And then we'll meet again next week and sing an awesome song. Got it? All right. I love you guys. See you soon. Bye. You're still here? I was just about to go eat my snack. Popcorn. Bye, guys.